your favorite player. I'm your favorite player, slave player. Guys, it can't even be true. Like, I, what's up? I don't even want to do a proper intro. This wasn't even supposed to be today's video. When I found the news out yesterday. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. I don't even need to say it, y'all. It happened. We knew the writing was on the wall. Not that, not this wall, because there ain't no writing on that wall. There better not be. I don't want to be cleaning that up. We knew it was going to happen. When we filled up our roster and we had all the spots taken up and we didn't have a damn spot available. We didn't have no money available for them. Whatever coach decides from there is what coach decides. <laughs> he went on the left. Michael Beasley went on about his win. Cook. I can cook. Oh, you can cook? Yeah. Really? They call me Chef Boy RBs, man. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, Michael Beasley is now a Los Angeles Laker. Damn, damn, damn. Now, for the, my new people, y'all here probably like, why the hell is CK going crazy right now? Because if you do not know, Michael Beasley was my favorite player on the team last season. Now, unless you're new to this channel, you already know what I'm about to say. Beasley! Awesome. But at the end of the day, it's a team of three superstars, and we didn't have anybody playing tonight other than my boy Michael Beasley, the real superstar. Michael Beasley provided us with so much joy, with laughs, with victories, with great performances, with entertainment. Who is your least favorite person on the team? Least favorite? I don't really have a. <laughs> I don't have a least favorite. Mine's is Trey Burke. Hey Trey, what up, boy? Especially when KP going out, Michael Beasley was our guy. A lot of the haters out there gonna say, nah, Beasley wasn't nothing. Beasley would show up when he wanted to show up and up. Beasley was important. Quarter, I think you were like 0 for 4, 0 for 5, but coming into the fourth and then you do what you did in the fourth and overtime. What are you thinking when you come in there? When? In the fourth. When? Uh, Not like W-H. Yeah. Oh, oh, excuse me. And this is why I think going to Lakers was actually a very, very good choice because they're going to have a good bench. But that doesn't matter. I don't know what this video is. I'm just upset. There's so many memories of, of Michael Beasley that I have in my heart. I mean, the biggest one was from day one, from the first night of the entire season. Michael Beasley was so sure that he was he was he was gonna be the man that he could hit any shot. That when he tweaked his ankle, my man, instead of going out or instead of staying down the Ronaldo style, he decided, no, it's my time to shine. And he went at that corner. He called for the ball. The double teams are gonna come his way. Mm. He had a bad day. You take one down. You see the sad On several occasions, Michael Beasley surprised New York and scored above 30 points. To the point where one game he was at the free throw line and we were so excited, so hyped up about the Beasley hype that we chanted MVP. And I chanted from my from my TV. I swear, for those who don't know anything about me or my channel, y'all looking at this video like, man, this dude crazy. Why am I subscribed to him? I just, you know, my teeth look good. So, Michael Beasley, if this video catches you, this is TK, your number one Knicks fan. I'm going to miss you, dog. And I'm very upset that you're not going to be playing for my New York Knicks this next season. I understand we're a young team. We're rebuilding. And we're turning into, we're not quite sure who we want to be. And you want to go out and get yourself a championship. I get it. I understand. Which is why I'm gonna have to make sure I come out to a Laker game because I live in LA. So I'm I'm still gonna see you all the time. It's just I'm not you're not gonna be on my team. That's the only thing. But at least I'll get to see you on TV and I can hear you on the radio. It's gonna be cool. All right, y'all. This has been a random quick video. I had you know for my my OGs, my real ones, the ones that have been here for the longest. You guys know that Michael Beasley was my guy. I was a huge fan of him. I still am a huge fan of him. Love what he did for New York. Love the culture he brought to the, the games, even though we weren't winning many games. He brought a very different attitude to the kind of team we had. You know, that rough rider, that, um, that grit attitude to the team along the side of like Trey Burke and those guys that, you know, really engulfed the Knicks attitude. And I love that about him. Michael Beasley will be missed. You know, he, he was a, a fun guy to have on the team. He will be missed, especially by me. I'm still debating if I'm gonna get me a Michael Beasley Knicks jersey. Like, I, ha I have to. Especially if they're on sale, I'm gonna get a Michael Beasley jersey. It's happening. You know what? We, let's look right now. Come on. All right, Michael Beasley jerseys. We're gonna see right now if they're on sale, okay? 
realize I was that high in the frame. Okay, now, I've been looking at these jerseys for a long time, and I was hoping that it would be an occasion where I would need to get it. I want one with the stitch. Like, I want I want the, I want one with the, uh, with the, with the, with the square space one on here, and the, uh, uh, what's it called, Nike. Okay, we're going through all of them. They got a Quinn jersey. Why is, oh, what? Got a Kyle Quinn jersey for $135. He, he is on the, he's on the Pacers. He is on the Pacers. Yeah, I'm editing in the background. The video that was supposed to be out today. Look, he's on the Pacers and they got his Knicks jersey. $135? And that's because the patch is on it? Well, at least I get my number nine back in 2K. <laughs> thanks, thanks, O'Quinn. So we are looking. I'm trying to find it. Like, we got Hardway. And I love how they have the jerseys with the, you know, with the badge on them now. But those ones are expensive. And the, there he is. Michael B. <gasps> it is still $135. I mean, I understand he just got signed today, but I mean, like, <sighs> Knicks fam, you have my guarantee. If that price goes down, if it is on sale, I will be all over that jersey. Not oh, they got a they got a sale, huh? I know a lot of you guys are looking at me crazy. You guys are like, come on, CK, what's the point? I love Beasley, and especially if the jersey's on sale. I jeez. Uh, what is that? What is that? Wait, it Oh shoot, did I accidentally go to this page where oh wait a minute. Oh wait a minute. What's up, Kevin Knox? How you doing, bro? If y'all haven't already, go check out T Public links in the description below. Get your shirt. I would say it's on sale, but the sale ends in about ten dollars, and by the time the video is out, the sale's over, so it's going to go back to twenty twenty dollars. Alright, y'all. Much love to you guys. Like I said, uh, this is a random video, but I had to say my piece on my guy Michael Beasley. Alright, love y'all. See you guys in the next video. Video's coming out Monday. It's a Mitchell Robinson video. It's different. You guys really wanted some more, you know, personal videos about players, and that's what this video is going to be about. It's going to be a new start to a new series. I really think you guys are going to like it. It's very different. Very, You'll like it, all right? It's coming out Monday. Mitchell Robinson. Love y'all. Let me know in the comments below how crazy I am about Michael Beasley or your favorite Michael Beasley moment, all right? I'm sweating. I'm going to catch you on the next one. We out here. Remember the phrase. You know what it is. Let's get it. I'm out. Hey, man. This this is, this is Michael Beasley. It's been real. It's been fun. But it ain't been real fun. <laughs> See y'all next time. Here we go again.